made or in a TV point, you know, from a TV point of view, it's a bit easier in terms of initial prototypes, but in a physical product, physical prototypes, they can be expensive, they can be, take, take a lot. But, but again, uh, you know, when you say expensive, if you've got a good product and if you've got to protect it, you can get money, you can get money. You guys will invest. And, uh, you know, you just have a bit, have to have a bit of notes. But like, uh, you know, and I'll help you in terms of protection because protection is the most important part, believe me. And, you know, we're, we're going to do an awful lot. Like, if any of you guys are out there having problems in terms of with your products, and whether it be stolen or whatever, contact me, we'll talk about it here. We'll, we'll, we'll out these guys here. And, and uh, there's plenty of them out there, you know. Don't, you know, I teach you how to protect them. I teach you how to walk into these people. You have a good idea. This is what I want. I have it protected. You know, I'll, I'll help you there. And if, if you stick with me over the next couple of years, you know, I, as I said, I've made all the mistakes. So, so that's that's the story of my first idea, the hook rest. I'll be doing a story. I I tell a story about the other four or five products of how I did it and you know how they came into my head. Where you know Simon Cole was the, the it was his fault I came up with the voice because I was watching Simon Cole at home one night slagging off somebody on the stage and I says to me in my own head I says what if you turn Simon Cole around and he couldn't see the person and just judge him on their voice and that's when I got it that's the moment I came up with the voice that was in 2005 2006 I didn't copyright it until a bit later but that's when I initially came up with the idea and I, I was sitting there so you know I wrote it down and that's really important as well like if your mind is all the time going like mine is, if you get a good idea, get out your phone, put it in your notes, because they'll go to your head as quick as they come into them. So, you know, that's a good tip. And build up your ideas and then have a look. Because there's, there's a lot of people out there, as I keep saying, that don't know what to do next if they have a good idea. And, you know, it's not rocket science. and You don't have to have a degree. You don't have to... As I said before, I'm a painter and decorator, I left school at 14, so you just, I learned it on the way, and I, you know, it cost me in the first couple of products, but I don't want that to happen to you, so join me on this journey, and uh, we know a few of these guys as well that have taken products from ordinary inventors, so, and, uh, get a good bit of music here as well, so I'll talk to you in the next segment, thank you.